equation 1 is the Einstein equation of the gravitational field surrounding any and every mass particle in the universe. Equation 1 is the Einstein equation of the gravitational field surrounding any and every mass particle in the universe. On 29 June 1972, R. Courier and Louis de Broglie of the French Academy of Sciences acknowledged to me Timothy Victor Creer that they had received two papers, paper one on the structure of the field and paper two, an essay, what is a completely unified pure field theory. Paper one on the structure of the field is an axiomatic treatise considering the child's atomistic hierarchy with the keen observation that the one over R squared universal gravitational field is the only field which is globally present throughout and unifying the infinite atomistic hierarchy. On the structure of the field was written in 1969 and 70. The, observ uh, the observation, keen observation in on the structure of the field wasn't at initially an observation which I made at nine years old on the evening of April 18th, 1955, the day that Albert Einstein had died, and we were taught in third grade during the daytime that all matter is made of atoms. Louis de Broglie's signature you see here is the father of the 1924 theory of wave mechanics. In particular, the wave mechanics of electrons in orbit about the atomic nucleus. Albert Einstein, in 1949, 
in his autobiography, twice described the appearance of Niels Bohr's 1913 solar system model of the atom as appearing, quote, like a miracle, and twice, Einstein, 1945, 1949 autobiography, quote, the highest form of musicality in science. Although Niels Bohr's 1913 solar system model of the atom was not a wave theory model of electrons in orbit and only in orbit about the nucleus, in Niels Bohr's 1913 solar system model of the atom, which Einstein described as appearing like a, mar a miracle, Niels Bohr's theory only, orbital theory only, described only a circular, circular electron orbital motion. Hence, the 1924 electron orbital theory of de Broglie enhanced the musicality of Bohr's, Niels Bohr's 1913 theory, solar system model theory of the atom, it enhanced that a hundredfold or more than that described by Einstein in appreciating Bohr's simple circular orbital theory. Hence, the letter of 1972 from de Broglie and his recognition of On the Structure of the Field, the recognition by both de Broglie and Courier, especially with de Broglie's signature, was appreciated by myself and by de Broglie as a possible further step in unveiling the harmony of the cosmos. Comment concerning the 29 June 1972 French Academy of Sciences, R. Courier and Louis de Broglie. Reply to myself, Timothy V. Creer. There's a lot of money in film, and, in and it's good for children. All right, like, beginning there. It was an authentic truth. And I'm going now. I'm this may well be the most important target for our protests. 
Personally, it scares me more than anything else the orange Godzilla has done. Please, don't ignore it, and please respond with action. Thank you. Make no mistake, this is a grab by a clever, devious, and power-hungry man. It is a pooch. This may well be the most important target for our protests. Personally, it scares me more than anything else the orange Godzilla has done. Please, don't ignore it, and please respond with action. Thank you. on the Einstein tablet e equals M C squared. This again is not a structure law. The third equation is not a structure law. Einstein's first equation is a structure law, a powerful structure law. E equals mc squared according to the child's atomistic hierarchy. There is a structure law, which means, according to billions, millions, and millions of children, that the substructure of a proton or neutron is a smaller elementary particle, a smaller universe, which on the structure of the field, which is available on Kindle, describes as a maximum galactic assemblage to the negative one. What does that mean? It's very simple. It's a smaller dimension of matter's construction. It has a superposition of gravitational fields from smaller elementary particles of construction, exactly as Carl Sagan says. So we will write it simply as MGA to the negative 1. MGA to the negative 1 is a structure law. And Hans Albert Einstein, my dear friend, I'm sure he, he agreed completely. So we write down the new enriched structure law to E equals MC squared. We're writing it down simply here as a summation, a linear summation. That's what this symbol means. A summation of smaller elementary particle, p to the negative one, in the child's atomistic hierarchy. One over r squared. Einst Newtonian, Einsteinian gravitational fields. So from a smaller dimension of matter, matter construction, the gravitational fields from 10 to the 80th of the smaller child's atomistic hierarchy. Smaller dimensions of matter construction, their gravitational fields diverge infinitely far right from the surface of our P not elementary particle, which is a neutron, a proton, electron. And in those gravitational fields from a smaller dimension of matter construction diverge like also Sprach Zarathustra and extend into here. Good for children. Right. There. It was an authentic truth. Okay, I'm going now. I'm it's good for children. Right. Getting there. It was an authentic.
truth. Okay, I'm going now. I'm beginning there. It was an authentic truth. Okay, I'm going now.